Hi, I'm Dr. Shankar Kumar, Senior Consultant practicing diabetes, internal medicine and uh, thyroid diseases. There are two types of diabetes. One is type 1 diabetes, what is called as insulin dependent diabetes, commonly seen in childhood. The other type of diabetes is type 2 diabetes, also called as non-insulin dependent diabetes. Now coming to the type 2 diabetes, what is called as non-insulin diabetes. After some time, the patients might need insulin. So this is called as insulin requiring. It is not insulin dependent, it is insulin requiring. Because of high sugars or some underlying uh, problem or complications like infections or some other uh, problem patient has to be undertaken for a surgery or patient develops a boil or severe infections. During that scenario, we try to put the patient on insulin temporarily. But once the infection thing settles down, the stress is also gone and the patient responds very well and the insulin requirement drastically comes down. So at this point of stage, you can always take out the insulin and patient can go back to his oral medications. But if the sugar is not under control with a standard dose of medications what a patient is taking, especially with oral drugs, then patient might have to continue insulin for his uh, long time. There is no hard and fast rule that patient has to continue. If the sugars are under very good control and if the insulin requirement is bare, bare minimum, the insulin can be withdrawn if patient is not very comfortable.